little sharp on the turn, don't you think? Sorry if I scared you. Where'd you get him? I'm not saying anything. He'll hear and spoil the surprise. He can hear that, too. How about you? He's not the easiest person in the world to buy birthday presents for. Bruce, you didn't get him a gift certificate. No. Cash. I mean, what do you buy for the man who has everything? <laughs> Looks like some kind of plant. Seems to be growing through his costume and into his body. Is he breathing? Barely. Someone must have breached the fortress. Agreed. Have a look around. Pupils aren't contracting even slightly. He must be cut off from all sensation. Kent, where are you? This is your wake-up alarm. Good morning, Kal-El, and happy birthday. Oh, thanks, Brainiac. Windows, please. Don't tell me it's morning already. Mm. That's what you get for partying all night. I was working. Come on, honey, you call that work? Covering the opening of the Argo City Museum of Modern Art? Hobnobbing with all the movers and shakers? Mm, a bunch of bores. You could have come, you know. Next time. Oh, please. I couldn't get you off this farm if I exploded a quantum bomb under your... Did you? Ugh. Come here, handsome. A gentle reminder. Kal-El and Vanel are expected at Jor-El's laboratory in precisely two hours and twelve minutes. And the back forty is overdue for inspection. Shut up! Hmm. So it was a gift. Teleported here from some alien culture, some grateful world. Or someone wanting you to think they were grateful. <laughs> <laughs>